Good morning y'all so it is about 7 30 so i'm about to pay some bills it's friday i got paid today and then i'm gonna start work um let me flip the camera around and kind of show you all the plan for this vlog slash this weekend so today's payday i'm about to budget we're gonna work i think i'm gonna go to target before we go to dinner so i can pick up the rest of the lights for the backyard um for dinner we're going to the melting pot to celebrate um one of my first friends that I met in Austin got promoted. She's actually leaving, so we're gonna celebrate, go to our favorite place. It's actually where I met her is the melting pot. So um, we're gonna go there and have some dinner. And I'm really excited because we love the melting pot. Um, tomorrow's blank, but tomorrow we'll be cleaning and organization, probably the bulk of this video. And then Sunday's gonna be rest day. My boyfriend's off, so we're just gonna spend some time together. Um, we're gonna watch some football and then I actually have a work event tomorrow so we have like an annual manager and provider like dinner we're actually gonna do a drive through movie theater that's local and then yeah that's the current plan okay also change of plans I'm actually headed to work so I'm going to work from the office for a little bit I have to drop up some stuff pick up some flyers do an office visit and then um on the way there we are gonna grab Starbucks Okay, y'all, so I am back home, so I have lunch, so I picked up some ramen, and then this collaboration came in from Erin Condren that I'm going to work on, and then I got one of my most recent orders from Cloth and Paper, and so I'm going to do an unboxing video after work, and then work on this collaboration probably tomorrow, and then eat some lunch and finish up work for the day. Good morning, y'all. So it is Saturday morning. Um, still have last night's makeup on. No shame. Um, so today is organization day. We're going to go to Target and get some shelves and maybe some picture frames for above the dresser. We'll see. Um, and then I also need to go to Office Depot, pick up stuff for work, come back, and then we're going to organize clothes. And okay, so clothes. here is what we are working with. I need to put my shoes back up from last night. Um, but this is what we're working with and so I used to have every inch of this closet filled and I've just realized that I don't use as much clothes as I thought I did and so a few things that I've done so in January I actually did like the biggest purge of them all and anything that I didn't wear in 2019 I got rid of and I put it in a bag and so what I like to do that my boyfriend doesn't like because it fills up the garage is I will take out everything that I haven't worn and then I keep it in the garage for a little bit and that way if I find myself wanting to use it or you know I change my mind and like I'm actually gonna wear it and I wanted to wear it I can simply just go back into the garage and take out whatever I need. What I've noticed is that if I do that it really helps and so it really helps I think just emotionally getting rid of clothes if that makes sense because I never go I haven't gone into the garage once and I have three bags in there that I need to donate um, but I've never gone into the garage once for anything that I've taken down. So what we're doing today is since it's pretty much the end of summer although it's still going to be warm there's a lot of things that I say like seasonally like okay so I'm going to keep this because I'll wear it you know in the winter um, or I'm going to keep this because I'll wear it in the summer and so now I'm going through like after each end of the season now that I did that big purge of things that I know I haven't worn and going back through those things where I said okay so I'll wear it in the summer and now anything that I haven't worn in the summer or I know I'm not going to wear in the fall or I know I'm not going to wear in the winter I'm going to get rid of. I went through and I got a good amount. I also took some stuff down um, that I'm going to put in the drawers and so I'll show you how I'm organizing the drawers. And so I have all of my pants and skirts down here. I have dresses that I've worn to weddings that are like wrapped down here. And then this is all kind of like casual. And then normally like my most worn clothes I put here and that way it's just easier to grab. That's kind of the organization. I do eventually need to go through um, my shoes because I have a lot 
and this isn't even all of them because they're like scattered all over the floors which is why you see all the holes but like this is literally filled up <laughs> um whenever um all my shoes are there which is kind of sad and they're like, like it goes back too like it's not even but I love shoes and I don't want to get rid of them but I feel like I really need to minimize um and then like all of these Uggs I probably I'm probably never going to get rid of so I used to get a pair of Uggs for my birthday every year from my parents since I was like I think from like middle school on so um, I'm still the same shoe size because I've always had big feet so they still fit so I don't want to get rid of these because because these have more like sentimental meanings I've had these for now over 10 years which is crazy um but I'm, I'm probably never getting rid of these these shoes I've already kind of decided that I'm going to get rid of over here because I know I never wear them and they're still in the boxes because I know I never wear them um but everything else I just got to figure out how I want to organize shoes, but that'll be for a different okay, day. So I'm still doing laundry. Um, so I have a couple more things that we're, are gonna go in these drawers, but for now I'm just gonna show y'all the initial setup. So I just had an extra container. So I have like these like earring backs and stuff for the drawer that I just threw in here. And then this will be where things just collect because I know it's gonna happen, so I might as well prepare for it. Um, but I have, several tops up here so i have um ones that i need to wear with a bralette these are ones that i normally layer so like i have lace ones and then like just a simple one from target that i usually wear with cardigans this is just um like casual tops and then this is like the flyaway i guess you can call it um, and then these are just tank tops that can be worn on their own that are extremely casual. And then these are just layering tank tops, but I think this is going to go in here because, um, I don't know what else to put in here. And then this will just probably be for more storage if needed, but, um, that's how I've organized this. The second one is pants. So, um, right now I just have my most commonly worn jeans down here. These look extra organized, but that's because it's new. It's not going to be like this. And once laundry starts coming in and I start, you know, just throwing things places, it's not, not going to look like this. Um, I have some of these casual skirts from Target that I wear, and then I have leggings here. And so I need to get, I, I don't know why I can only buy two leggings. I guess I got rid of some earlier this year, but, um, I'm probably gonna hang these up and then this will probably just be for jeans and leggings more towards the end of the year. But for now, this is what we have. And then down here is all four hoodies, which I love hoodies. So um, I wear hoodies all year round. This is probably like my favorite thing to wear. I think probably in every video I'm wearing a hoodie at least at some point. So, um, I keep all of my hoodies down here. And then I'll show you all the other um, storage so just so you all can see how I've organized all of my clothes. Okay, so this is our other dresser. And so as I mentioned, this is my boyfriend's side and then this is my side. So I have bras in here. Behind here is um, bralettes and this is like Spanx. And then this is all underwear. And then I have socks back here. These are all like knee high boot socks. I don't have really any like no show socks. I wear my boyfriend's. Um, this drawer, we have the organizers again. So I have um, workout clothes back here. And then um, this is like 90s and lingerie. This is like PJ sets from Victoria's Secret. Shorts, cause I mainly wear these even if I don't wear the tops. And then Nike shorts that I would love to wear around the house. And then down here are all of my t-shirts because I think y'all know I love my t-shirts. So I have different things from school, just superhero ones, Dallas Cowboy ones. This is just like all of my loungewear slash wear around the house area. So that is all of my clothes and how I organize everything. All right, so I just got back from Target and I picked up the shelves. So my boyfriend is more than likely gonna wanna put these up since he has this problem with wanting to have everything straight. So I'm gonna save these for him, but I also found this steel over the cabinet organizer for underneath the sink so I can also organize that. So I'm gonna set this up and then save this for when he gets home.
Hey Money Y'all, so it is Sunday morning and so we are gonna clean and organize my office. So let me flip the camera around and kind of show y'all everything that I'm gonna do today. So here's everything that we're kind of working with. So I've just been piling trash over here. And so I have one big trash bag to um, put it all up. But um, out here isn't too bad. I do want to restructure this since I moved my jewelry downstairs. The main task at hand is going to be this closet. So this is like my storage closet. And I just finally want to go through everything and get rid of stuff. I have clothes that I was going to sell, but now I'm just going to donate. Um, and I just have been piling stuff in here. So we are going to go through all of this or most of it at least. And I just want this to be clean. Um, this was in here and so I just moved it out. I put all my bags on here and um, we have some storage bins. So don't really have a plan. Um, I figured I'd just go through things and kind of figure everything out as it goes along. But we're going to probably start out here and then move to the closet. Okay, so here is what we're currently working with. So this was over here, but what I think I'm going to do is get hanging organizers and I have a love-hate relationship with them, but I think this is going to be the best solution since it's in a closet. Um, but I think I'm going to have some hanging down here so I can put all my purses in here and that way I feel like if I have more room for junk, I'm going to collect stuff. So like I, it doesn't fit on these shelves or in these drawers, or in that organizer, I'm gonna get rid of it. Okay, so this is all mirrors crap, but I got everything cleared out, filled up our trash can and our recycle. Um, so these items here, I'm actually going to look for a basket. So I'm going to run to Target and I'm going to look for hanging holders to place here and then maybe a bin to go underneath um, to put like my filming stuff in and that way I can easily pull it out whenever I need it. Right now, I just have this stuff here. So this is stuff that I'm going to de-stash and I also need to get stuff to send off things for when I de stash. Um, and then I just have my suitcase and this we do here. This is my work bag and I put some totes in it for now. Um, but all of this is clear, so I'm probably gonna use this for like large totes because I have a lot of large totes. And then all my smaller stuff I'm gonna have here um, hanging. And then I feel like I should get two and I can always use it for something else if needed. Um, but yeah, current plan, I'm gonna go shower, get ready for the day and then head to Target and then we'll do this. Okay, so I'm actually gonna return this because I don't need it. So once I started putting everything up, I realized that I could put all of my bags up here and I like the way it looks. Right, so. And then for the final setup, which makes me so happy that there's just so much room in here, um, I don't like clutter in spaces and I'm so happy that I finally got rid of so much stuff, but here is everything and I'll go through everything kind of, um, one by one. So I'm going to stop from, I'm going to start from the top and work my way down. So these are all of my purses for the most part. I think I have a few more in the garage from like when I was a teenager that like my mom got me that I don't want to get rid of. And then this is stuff that I've purchased like since college and 
have had. So I don't have any like luxury, luxury purses. Um, my goal this year was actually to get a Gucci purse, but I'm paying off debt instead. And so um, I'm happy with my purse collection. I love my purse collection. So I have this black Tory Burch purse. It is a Nordstrom exclusive that I got during um, an end sale and I love it. This used to be my work purse and I might actually alternate between this one and this one because I do love using that one still. I feel like I haven't used it in a while. Um, these are the Kate Spade and Betty and Veronica Archie Comics um, backpack and tote that I love and then I have the wallets and stuff in there that I've purchased but I am so happy that I got my hands on both of these. Uh, and then over here we have the rest of my Tory Burch purses. So um, I call that one my fall bag. I only use it during fall. I got it at the outlet two or three years ago and I love it. The one all the way, the navy one all the way in the back. Um, my main purse before I got my Louis Vuitton was actually the other large tote in the back and that is the Robinson tote. And then we have like my small bag. So this one was a birthday present to myself um, when I left a job that I hated and then I have the matching wallet in there. Um, and then these three, um, the navy blue one was from Sam for a Christmas present. The, I think our second year dating, I love this purse. And then the blush one in the back, I have the matching mini wallet in there as well. That's from um, an in sale. And then um, this white one is actually my newest one. I just purchased it a couple of weeks ago with my mom when we went shopping for her birthday. And I got it at the outlet and I love it. I think it's the Emerson if I remember right. The only one that I know for sure is that that one is the Robinson, the tan one. Um, everything else, I don't really know the name, but if y'all are interested, let me know and I can look at my past purchases. But I absolutely love my purse collection. I feel like I have a bag for every occasion. Over here, um, this Louis Vuitton box has wallets. I need to round up my other wallets. So let me just show y'all. Um, so one of the Archie comic ones, the other one's in my Louis. I have this Robinson one and it matches that bag. I have another mini black Robinson that I have, I believe, in here. This one I have a matching wallet for, so that one just keeps in there. And then I use that wallet with that bag because they're from the same collection. And then um, I have another pink wallet in there. Um, generally, I just use the matching wallet with the bag and not for anything else. Um, this one kind of has a wallet in there and the others I just use any wallet. So have that and then in here is school items so I have my degrees in here like the holders cap and gowns and then up there is a bag full of bags so like reusable bags and then moving down here my Louboutins are here just because I don't know where else to put them right now I think I'm gonna put them back on my bookshelf um, but for now we're just gonna keep them there this has old work stuff so like name tags mementos awards stuff like that I really narrowed that down before um, these have PR items. These are all new items that I've received from primarily Erin Condren, um, but it's just new items and I use them for like giveaways and stuff like I always do fillers. This has interchangeable covers for my Erin Condren life planners. This is um, petite planners, planning packs, planning pouches, different things like that from Erin Condren. And then we have all of my previous life planners and this is a lot of like miscellaneous Erin Condren accessories. We have all of my textbooks that I've kept so far and then moving down I know this is kind of like an eyesore because everything else really goes together but this is stuff that I'm going to eventually de-stash. I just need to get to it. I'm probably going to throw it in a bag and put it somewhere but de-stashing all that. Um, the, I have these Erin Aaron Condren items that um, I'm going to keep and I need to figure out what I'm doing in here and then I might keep stuff up here and that way I can like easily grab some items. We'll see. Um, but I put the baskets here because I think these are like really cute. It blends with like the black hardware on here and I think it looks really good together. But this is stuff that I use for blogging. So backgrounds, backdrops. That is my tripod that I record my planner videos on. This is just my tripod that I use for blogging. Um, and then these are blog light. So I just keep these on the side. That is the bag for my Neverfold in the box. And I'm just keeping that in there. And then inside these drawers is just office supplies. So hole punch, disc punch, 
um, A5 and Personal Punch. My label maker, this has cell phone cases and stuff in there. Chargers, calculator, cartridges for here, extra ink. This was a charger for my camera and just other miscellaneous items. In here is the one that I need to figure out what I'm gonna do. So I have my laminator. It was like a $20 laminator from Target that works amazingly. And then I have all these Aaron Condren storage boxes. These two have um, stickers in here, but these have items, but all of these are blank. So I need to figure out if I want to stash them, keep them, and what to use them for. Um, same with these. I don't know what I'm going to use them for anymore. I initially purchased them to organize my coffin paper stickers, but now I put them on a disc. Um, so now I need to figure out what I want to do with them or if I'm just going to destash them as well. And then last drawer. These are all Aaron Condren notebooks. I have so many because most PR boxes have um, like a notebook in here. So these are all notebooks. And I used to buy a lot for school too and like have like a backup just in case. But these are all notebooks. Um, I have some journals here. This is a pouch full of chargers. Um, this has just different office supplies. And then these have stickers, I believe. Yep, this one's blank. Um, stickers, and then I have like different Aaron Condren storage items. But that is everything. And then I have a couple of boards that were supposed to go on my wall that I took down just underneath there, so they're out of the way for right now. But yeah, that is a tour of the closet. I just grabbed one of the S hooks and put my tote here for work and um, I'll just probably keep that in there. That's my suitcase and then just my Scooby-Doo. But that is everything here. Um, but yeah, that is actually going to be it for this video. So for the rest of the day, I'm going to watch the Cowboys game, which is about to come on while I edit, get everything uploaded. And then we are going to our provider dinner. So it's a um, healthcare provider and manager dinner. Um, that our company hosts every year and it's gonna be at a drive-in movie theater this year so we can all social distance but still have that event and that's another thing we really have planned for tonight we're gonna have dinner there and then that's it for the day and so next video we'll have file management and we're actually gonna go over goals because I have a lot of goals and I'm really excited to share them with y'all and I'll share how I've been using the cloth and paper five year planner inserts um I'm really excited to share a lot of stuff with y'all on that um and we'll throw on other stuff too I'll go through everything that y'all have asked to see and we'll throw stuff in there as well um but yeah other than that that is going to be it for this video thank you guys so much for watching mm -hmm.